You, you might know Judge Faith Jenkins from her popular show, Divorce Court. Her husband, Grammy-nominated singer, songwriter, and D.C. native Kenny Lattimore. This Valentine's weekend, they're hosting a, a virtual concert and conversation called An Evening of Love with Faith and Kenny. The event follows a special two-part episode of Divorce Court that aired last week. Take a look. I also happen to know someone who's had some level of success in the music business, and I asked him to come here today to listen to this case in your testimony and come and share about his experiences and hopefully broaden your perspective and give you some insight into what this business is really about and the work that it takes. He's an R&B legend, and he also happens to be my husband, Kenny Lattimore. Why would you bring in Kenny? <laughs> he cussing in the courtroom. What is that about? All right, this morning, Judge Faith and Kenny Lattimore join us to talk all about their event, Divorce Court, and their, their, their love story. Uh, good morning to you both. Good to see you. Good morning. Good, good to, see, good to you see you, too. All right, so first of all, we got to talk about the event. Uh, explain what the event is all about and how people can get access to it. Well, we partnered with Black Rod Magazine, and it is a virtual and interactive concert and conversation. We're gonna be celebrating love and we're gonna be talking about love and, and our journey through love through music. And I got the idea wisdom after I finished taping this first season of Divorce Court, I saw how a lot of the couples really struggled this year during the pandemic to stay connected and uh, try to have, find those romantic moments and romantic times together when they really couldn't do a lot of the things that we take for granted, like go out to dinner at their favorite restaurant or, or live concerts or the theater. So I asked Kenny if he, if we could do something together mm -hmm. and have a virtual live stream with his full band, a concert and conversation, just so everyone is clear, I'm the conversation part <laughs> of this event. <laughs> and uh, we're joining together. It's going to be amazing. We, um, his full band and the music and the songs, very encouraging and uplifting. So I'm really excited to be able to do this where people can enjoy a wonderful date night or even if, if if you're single, just a wonderful night of music at home safely. All right. So, so Kenny, we know you sing and sing the love songs. Judge Faith, we know you're, you're doing divorce court. They kind of don't mix together, but you two are together, and you survived the pandemic because I've talked to you both. And it, obviously, <laughs> it's, it's challenging. It was challenging to be together when there is no pandemic, but when you throw that pandemic in there, it just takes it to another level. So you got any um, advice that you can share with us uh, about uh, dealing with a, with a mate? Well, I always tell people, you know, when, when you're making a choice about who you want to partner with and life partner with, make sure you like the person sure. as they are. <laughs> Radical acceptance. Don't come in thinking, you know what, I pick you, but I want you to change all these things about yourself. <laughs> because what happens is we got married five days later, went into quarantine for an entire year. So it's, you know, when you make the choice, you're going to spend a, you're going to spend a lot of time with the okay. person that you're with, with us even more time than we anticipated. So I was really happy that I chose someone that I really liked being around a lot. Because, you know, before, you know, Kenny's always been never too busy. <laughs> he was really not busy this year. <laughs> <laughs> so it was great. Kenny, go ahead. You, you want to add to that? Well, no, and adding to that, I would just say that you also want to bring your authentic self. Thank mm -hmm. God. I mean, she is the woman who she presented herself to be <laughs> because I've watched Divorce Court too, and folks have been like, mm. they presented themselves to be one thing and they were totally different, or their ideals or core values were different. So um, that is a, a huge thing is that we talked about our core values and who we were. Mm -hmm. And then you want to, you know, practice a self-love and bring your best self to the relationships. Yeah, I, and it wasn't always, you know, we, we, I did bring my authentic self, but, you know, there were, I, I told him I could cook. Mm -hmm. There were, you know, when you're stuck at home and you can't go out, right. you have to cook a lot. Okay. There were, there were some days that were better than others. Okay. But and we 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 persevered. We, we made, made we made romantic. <laughs> okay. You all right? So and Judge is from you're from the South. You're from Louisiana, right, Judge? Yes. All right. Yes. So you, I mean, there's a, a level of expectation that a, a Southerners know how to cook. Look yeah. at Kenny. High bar. Yeah, high yeah, the, bar. The bar. <laughs> Kenny, did she pass? <laughs> did she pass, Kenny? Oh, totally. She totally passed. <laughs> I'm a very lucky guy. You're, you're a lucky guy. And also, Judge, I, you went to Southern Baton Rouge for law school. Is that, is yes, that correct? Yes. I, yes, I did yes, not yes. know that. Your HBCU uh, product, uh, you know, I know you went to school, another school as well, but you know how HBCU, we, we claim you. Right? <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> well, well, thank you both for uh, spending time with us this morning. Um, appreciate your time and continued success and, and keep that love together because we all know 
We know that Very there will be you. days. Thank you, Wisdom. And you there will be days like this, Kenny. Jenkins.com or KennyLattimore.com for all the information <laughs> on our virtual this weekend. So God bless. There you go. He gave out all the information. He didn't hear me when I said I knew that there'd be days like this. <laughs> Just give it to him again. <laughs> <laughs> Thank